guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be teaching you a very popular song by ACDC. You probably know it. It's Back in Black from their famous Back in Black album. Um, it's pretty simple. mainly takes three chords for the verse and... five chords for the chorus. So, it's pretty simple. Um, I will be teaching you... I'll be teaching this to you today. This is part one. Um, the solo will likely come in a um, um, video in the future. So right now, let's just dive right in and figure the verse and chorus out. Hey, guys. So we're learning back in black. So do not need a capo. Should probably set this down. Um, so you don't need a capo. Five pretty simple chords. Um, be sure to turn your gain up because this is a rock song. So, first three chords that you need to know. E power chord. Open, low E string. Uh, second fret of the A string. Everything else muted. Second chord you need to know. Just a plain old D. So that's going to be open on the D string, 2nd fret of the G string, 3rd fret of the B string, and 2nd fret of the high E string. So, And then the last chord you need to know for the verse is your A power chord. It is open on the A string. And second fret on the, what is that? Oh yeah, the D string. And mute the e, low E string and the high three, the highest three strings. So, so you got your E power chord, your D, and your A power chord. So if you notice, the song starts off with a little... Thing where you just put your palm over it so it's muted and you just go one two three four five six one two so what we did is we went from the E power chord to the D to the A power chord so have this little lick it goes so it goes um you're gonna use the third fret of the high E string and you're gonna go and pull off so third fret pull off B string third fret pull off and then the second uh second fret of the G string you go bend and pull back Go back to the normal state and pull off. So it sounds like play that again. So so far we have for the beginning one, two. Now we just repeat those three chords, but we don't play the same lick, we go so you're going to keep this finger right here on the second fret of the A string, and then hammer on to the fourth fret of the low E, pluck the A, hammer on to the fifth of the E, Hit the A again, hammer on to the sixth, and you might have to move your pointer finger for this, but you go hit the A and then hammer on to the seventh fret of the high string. So you have and then you're gonna have this new lick. 
you go. Fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh. Yeah, sixth, seventh. And so you play that, so you go. And then you go to this little part that goes like... first part is so that's A power chord E power chord and then you're gonna do this little thing you're gonna take the E power chord and you're gonna add your ring finger or I play with my ring finger you're gonna add the fourth fret of the D string so so you have that so it goes A E and then back to A, and then back to this. So it goes. Let's do that again. And then the next one, uh, you guys should know the G chord, which is third um, fret of the low E, second fret of the A, um, open D, open G, open B, third fret of the high E. Another way you can play this is you can add the third fret of the B. They pretty much sound the same. They're both Gs. So you're gonna go, so the first part is and then you repeat that. And then you go to this. G, D, A, and then this is kind of tricky. You go, so A, hammer on to the third, but then you pull that in off, so. Wait, actually, you pluck it too. So it goes. G, D, A, third fret, bend, pull off. So, so far you have. And then you repeat the first part. And then you play G, 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 D, 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 and you go back to the verse. So pretty much you just repeat that the whole song. There is a solo section, but that is not in this video right now. And so that's pretty much it. You go. repeat that the whole song.
Okay guys, that's all I have today. So I did ACDC's Back in Black from their famous Back in Black album. Um, like I said, it's only five chords, pretty simple song. Um, I will be teaching the solo in a future video. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Definitely subscribe. Please subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.